Alright, I'm gonna use this like it's L'Oreal. It's a L'Oreal eyeliner, but I use it as my dip brow. I had gotten a new one because my sister had taken my other. But and then I'm also using this Sephora angled brush. When I do my eyebrows, I never touch this spot. And if I touch it, it's because I lightly did, I got the excess from the brush and brought it up there. I don't touch that part normally. You like want to get light handed as soon as you get to right here. Now with the top part of my eyebrow, I'm gonna line it, but I'm not gonna start all the way up here. I'm gonna start like back here, where like all my hair starts to get like bald spots. And start from the back of my, the tail of my eyebrow. And you know how we do that line right here? You're going to stop wanting to put product as soon as you get to that spot right there. But then again, you want to go light-handed right here. I'm gonna like kind of comb it out, but then kind of like brush the product to like make it kind of fade. Um, for concealer, I'm using my Maybelline Shed 20 concealer. I get it on my hand. And then for to conceal my eyebrows, I'm using the Wet n Wild flat brush. And then don't dip your brush back into it so that way there's like less whatever the extra product was on the brush just use it to conceal the top Oh, and when you conceal, don't touch this part right here. Okay, taking this brush, I don't know where it's from because I like kind of finessed it for my mom. Sorry, mom. But it's like a flat, bigger version of a brush. Okay, now with this brush, I'm just gonna conceal. But like when I do it, I'm not gonna touch like all the way up here. I'm gonna bring it down here and go like this. You're gonna bring this concealer a little forward, but then not straight, but like kind of down. 